My name is Helen and I live in Minnesota. Today is September 6, 1946. I am 47 years old and I live with my 18 year old daughter Mary in a cottage near a lake. In the morning, I make tea for me and my daughter. I go for a walk down the forest at 9 o'clock, buy fresh baked bread from my lovely neighbor Tessa and greet her husband and her son good morning. I arrive at the lake and bask in the golden sun for minutes until my daughter picks me up to go to our bookstore. That is my morning routine. My name is Helen and I live in Minnesota. I am not sure what day it is today, but it is a Sunday and it is 9 o'clock in the morning. I am 48 years old and I live with my daughter. I don't know where she is and sometimes I want to call her. but. Her name flies out of my mind. It's Mary. Mary! Her name is Mary. Yes, Mary. In the morning, I used to make tea, but I keep burning my fingers from the hot water. So Mary does all the work for me. I go for a walk, and these people are waving at me, and I'm not so sure why. I arrive at the lake, and I realize it's cold. Why am I even here? I walk back, but I was called by somebody. She brought me to the bookstore. That was my morning routine. My name is Helen, and I think I am back in New York. It is freezing. I don't know why my sister is crying in the kitchen. I think I know what to do, but as soon as I went out of the door, I don't see the garden that we have. I was just surrounded by forest. I thought it was still 9 o'clock in the morning until my sister Mom. called me. Mom. No. This, this is it my sister? Mommy? She looks like my sister, but she calls me mommy. Come on, let's go back inside. She asked me to go back inside and I listen. I don't remember what I did this morning. It's 9 o'clock in the morning and I want to go to the beach. Mother isn't around, so I can do what I want. I went out and walked through the forest to the beach, and when I was called by my sister, I looked back and ran. And I was having a time of my life. I felt my lungs burning, but I felt nothing but joy. I finally saw the shore, and I jumped right in. I swam and swam, but my sister's cries grew louder. I'm starting to realize this isn't the beach. Why am I in a frozen lake? I'm so, I'm so cold, cold and people are surrounding me. He carried me back and I apologized to my sister to not tell our mother what I did. She hugged me and she told me that she loves me so much. This morning was a little scary. It's still 9 o'clock in the morning. <laughs>